This one is so, oh my God, it's so inviting. It's so delicious. Like I, I, I loved it. I love this one. So if I had to recommend one. Hello and welcome to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Kali Nari. And on here, we talk about various fragrances that are in my collection. And we also talk about fragrances that's either been recommended by my subscribers. They're interested in it. So they tell me about it and I try to see if I have it in my collection. If I don't, uh, then I reach out to people who do, right? So if it's one that I'm going to actually wear, I would actually get some usage out of, then I do actually add it to my collection. There will be a few that you might recommend that I, I probably wouldn't add. I'll come back and add, uh, give you my opinion on it off camera. Uh, because I'm in the stage, I have well over 200 plus fragrances. So I just don't want to keep adding fragrances uh, just to add them. But today's topic is going to be about a line that I just came across. Uh, it was a recommendation uh, from someone on Instagram. And uh, so I just started to, I bought one of them, tried it out. I hardly ever like to blind buy, but this was one of them that I did actually blind buy. Actually, I bought two from the line. If you've never heard of me, this is your first time ever coming across my page. I want to say welcome. I'm Claudia Nari, and I would advise you to follow all of my social medias. Initially, Instagram, that's where I started off at. There you give a good idea of what I talk about, um, uh, fragrances I'm wearing daily, so forth, so on. And for all of my returning subscribers, you know that I truly do adore you. I appreciate you. We are growing as a family, and that is all because of you. But today, we're going to talk about, if you saw the thumbnail, it's going to be a versus. Uh, because the recommendation was for me to either get Amber, Amber uh, Malachi or get Rose Malachi. And I'm going to tell you which one of them that I actually truly did enjoy. Uh, I like them both. I give you heads up. I do like them both. But one I liked a little bit more. And if that sounds interesting to you, then stay tuned. So the first one that I'm going to do is going to be Rose Malachi. Rose Malachi is, it's, I love the simpleness of the bottles. Let me first start off by saying that. I think the bottles are absolutely very simplistic, very nice. This is a line that's been around for years. And uh, with Rose Malachi, it was supposed to have like a touch of rose with some floral notes, spicy and woody and so forth, so on, right? So this is where the initial recommendation had came from. Uh, I had mentioned that I was not really that big on rose fragrances and they were like, well, you haven't, tr you should try this one. And it's good. It is it's a very good one. Rose Malachi, uh, it has saffron. It has uh, Denmark rose, which is like a, very dark, sultry rose, and it also had um, cedar. And that's all the notes that's written. And that's what you basically get. Um, according to the brand, it is supposed to join together spices, woody notes, and provoke a character of uh, simplicity. It's supposed to have uh, symbols of rose, like of love, right? And then it's supposed to have this velvety, dewy petal, uh, kind of undertone to it. So it's like when you get the red roses and you smell them for the first time, that is what it was supposed to give you. And then it's supposed to have a bit of warmthness to it. So it's going to be warm and um, almost like warm skin. So that was the description of it. And it's actually beautiful. It's a beautiful scent. But I will tell you that Initially, I was very gung-ho because it had saffron, right? So I wanted that more creamy, soft saffron mm -hmm. note. I'm not getting that. What I am getting is the rose. So if you truly love rose, this is your fragrance. And the company name is Chapar, right? I was saying Chapard, and I researched it to make sure that I did say the name correctly. And it's the, the D is silent, so it's Chapar, right? Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. The initial one that they they came out with was Oud Malachi. So the line has several. Um, I didn't want to get Oud Malachi, which basically means 
Kai means royal. So it was like Oud royal, rose royal, and then there's an amber royal, right? I didn't want the Oud one because I have Oud uh, sat mood and I'm, I'm pretty happy with that one. But rose Malachi, if you are a rose lover, this is the one I'm going to tell you to go get. All right? And the last one in this comparison is going to be Amber Malachi. Right? Amber. And oh, <laughs> I guess I don't even have to tell you from the laugh that you hear. I absolutely, positively adore this one. This one is so, oh my God, it's so inviting. It's so delicious. Like I... I I loved it. I love this one. So if I had to recommend one, Amber uh, would be the one. This one here is unisex. It's a fragrance that I think a woman can wear and be sexy. I know that this probably is amazing on a man. Uh, I love this one. The notes in this one is Amber, Incense, Bourbon, Vanilla, Latamin, Orange Blossom, and Papyrus. Just, it's, it's just sexy. Now, I will tell you this. If you are a person who haven't really got into incense, you're not really into smoky scents, then maybe this one might not be your go-to. You might want to give your nose a little longer to kind of get into uh, fragrances where then you might be interested in it because it, it does have incense and it, it has a sexy smokiness to it. Like to me, this is a night on the town. This is dressed up face beat to the gods. This is a slinky dress outfit. That's what this is to me. That's how sexy I think this is. This is gorgeous, positively gorgeous. Uh, if I had to recommend one, again, I would over the, not saying that the Rose Malachi is not good. That's this one here. But what you have to like Rose and it's, it's that dark, dark Rose. This one, if you are an Amber lover like myself, this is it. This is it. This, oh my God, I sprayed it in the top because I don't have one of my sprayers down, my spray uh, cards down here. This is, and it gets better. It's one of those fragrances that get better over time. Amber Malachi. Malachi or Malachi, I'm not quite sure. I like this one. All right, so, so far I told you I just got into this line. So these are the ones that I have. There are several, and I'm going to list them out for you. Uh, the other ones in the collection is Black Incense uh, Malachi. Malachi, I hope I'm saying it right, Malachi. Right, and then there is a must Malachi. There is a uh, the Oud Malachi, which is the original one uh, that they started off with. So those are the other ones that are in the line. I did tell you that Oud was the one they initially started off with, and then they started to go. Amber was one that I had to get, and I'm happy that I did. And then, of course, the recommendation was the Rose one. So in this competition, I believe Amber would be the one to win. If you have come across this line and there are others in the line, because I'm just getting into this line and there's others that you think I should actually know about. I remember uh, how I got into fragrances was a teacher. It was a teacher that, uh, God, she smelled so good. Her name was Miss Palmer. She smelled so good every time she passed in the uh, in a hallway uh she'll walk past you in class uh she she used to wear cashmere and i'm gonna put a picture of it right here cashmere the original cashmere i know there, there are a couple of flankers for it but she used to wear cashmere <laughs> and it just it just smelled like a classy lady that's all i could think of when when she would pass me classy lady so that's also from this line I truly do enjoy doing this. Please keep the recommendations coming. Tell me what you're interested in. I am just the host of your channel. So please tell me all of what you want to talk about, things you want me to get into. Uh, when I put up my poll, you all say that you uh, wanted to see uh, more uh, layering videos. And I can do that. And you also were interested in more Middle Eastern fragrances. And I can do that too. So if I did not add it to the poll, but there is a particular collection that you want to hear more about, tell me about it in the chat. I would love to hear about it. I'll add it into the rotation and to keep them coming. 
Uh, this is always a pleasure. I always say that, but it really is. I really do enjoy this. Uh, in my surroundings, I don't really have a lot of people to talk about fragrances with. So to be able to talk about it with you is absolutely important to me. So on that note, I'm going to bid you the greatest day, the wonderful night, whenever it is that you got an opportunity to see this video, my only request is that you share it. So more people come over to the, uh, come over to our community, join our community. We are growing rather rapidly and that is all because of you. So on that, I'm going to say, I'm gonna see you in the next video.